happened, not if. So you're telling me how to do my job? No, I'm telling you how the law works. Okay. I just want to know who we're talking to. Good citizen. Uh, Good citizen. Okay. Are you telling me I'm a bad citizen? I'm not saying you are. Okay. He was making sure it works. But it, he couldn't do that in his own property, in his own backyard. Because he's looking to start a problem. No. Nobody's looking to start a problem. Did I call you guys out here? Did I, did I go up to anybody? No. Hi, good citizens. Thank you for coming to my channel. If you are a first time viewer, please don't forget to subscribe and hit that bell for future video notifications. This video is from YouTube channel HCCW. The original link is in the description. Please subscribe and give credit where credit is due. Guys, when you are done watching this video here, please don't forget to post your comments. And as always guys, if you would like to support my channel, please don't forget to subscribe. Enjoy the video. Let's get it into it. What was your name and badge number, officer? Sergeant Murray, 3811. What was your name and badge number, officer? Officer Beckman. And I won't ask for yours because, or actually, can I have your name and badge number, please? Officer Crandall, badge 382. Thank you. But no. So you're blaming Am it on I free the person to go? that called it in. Am I free to go, sergeant? So you're blaming it on Am the person Am I free to go, sergeant? Am I being detained? I, I don't answer questions. We have your name and info? Am I free to go, sergeant? Can you get his name? Wow, well, we need your name and info. Did I commit a crime? We're identifying you. Did I commit a here? crime? All we have to do is identify. Did I commit a crime? We're just here to identify. Did you. I commit a crime? Did I commit a crime, Sergeant? That's what we're here for. Am I free to go, Sergeant? Again, that's what we're here to do. Am I right? able to continue on my was, path and my travels? Property damaged? Did you shoot it at Did anybody? Did anybody call and, ask, and say there was property damage? Did anybody say, hey, somebody's out here pointing a gun at me or a pistol or what looks like a pistol at me? Actually. No, they, they said from this officer right here that they, they heard something and it no. sounded like it. No. They, they saw us carrying it. A person was carrying it in their hand. In okay. Her was I pointed at anybody? We don't know, right? From your caller, was I pointed at anybody? Okay, so we have a right to investigate that. So you investigate it. Investigate. Your investigation has nothing to do with my identification. Your investigation consists of you coming out to find out if it's a... A firearm or if it's a legal part of my property and it's a legal part of my property it's not a firearm state law states if I'm over 16 years old I'm allowed to obtain and be able to carry a not, paintball not okay so is there a crime committed the problem that we do have in town is that persons shoot these in the movies. Okay. They even shot okay. Police car. My did squad did anybody car call in and say a car got shot? Not yet. But we, if it were to happen, okay. we need to know who you were. No. If, if that did it, yes. No, no, not if. We don't go off of ifs. We go off of if the crime happened, not if. So you're telling me how to do my job? No, I'm telling you how the law works. Okay. I just want to know who we're talking to. Good citizen. Uh, Good citizen. Are you telling me I'm a bad citizen? I'm not saying you are. Okay. He was making sure it works. But it, he couldn't do that in his own property, in his own backyard. Because he's looking to start a problem. No. Nobody's looking to start a problem. Did I call you guys out here? Did I, did I go up to anybody? No. It's me and him walking down the street solely minding our business. Am I free to go, Sergeant? Are we free to go, Sergeant? Am I being detained, Sergeant? No. Thank you. I'm going to continue on my way. We both are. You guys enjoy the rest of your night and be safe. Excuse me? Excuse me? One more time? Excuse me? I can look up power schools. Have a good night, sir. Oh, so you're gonna you're gonna threaten to try to go around the way? Did I? Are you putting words in my mouth? Well, you're saying that you're gonna try to look up my son's school. Please, please. It's funny though because please, please. he's not school age. Okay, please. if you were if you were any kind of trained or anything like that, you'd be able to distinguish whether or not somebody's over the age age of eighteen or not. I advise you all just kick rocks and go back to work. Hey, it's a free country, isn't it? I'm able to stand. I'm waiting for you guys to leave the area because I'm not going to be followed. 
I'm not gonna walk. You've already, you you've know, already said. Put yourself between me and my squad car. I will stand over here. It will sit on the ground, and I will stand right here for you, officer. Being the subject of a police call does not obligate you to disclose your personal information to law enforcement. Individuals are safeguarded by rights that grant them the option to remain silent. These rights find their basis in the Fifth Amendment of the United States Constitution highlighting the importance of an individuals being aware of their legal protections. It's crucial to comprehend the boundaries of uh, law enforcement authority in various situations to ensure the well-being of you and uh, your family during encounters with the police. Both law enforcement officers and the public should possess uh, knowledge about your constitutional rights, and uh, individuals should feel empowered to assert these rights when necessary. This empowerment contributes to maintaining a delicate balance between public safety and individual rights. It's essential to remain to remember that the the primary motive behind establishing establishing constitutional rights was to restrict the government's power. Our nation, nation's founding fathers fathers having experienced the oppression of British rule amid to establish a governmental uh, system that shield shielded individual freedoms from government overreach. Those, uh, it is imper imperative uh, to al always recall and uh, appreciate the reasons for the ex existence of the rights we possess and exert exerces. That's going to do it for this video. Much love to our video. Make sure you use the link in the description to show them some love and check out his most recent videos. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel. See you in the next video. Bye.